Hello guys and welcome back to the crazy Minecraft video where today Minecraft Rooney Zombie has gone ahead and invited us to this awesome village where apparently these villagers need our help. It seems like they're about to be hit by a giant apocalypse and if we don't help them no one else will. So let me go and take out these iron tools as well as this book and let's go see what they want us to do exactly. Hello Naveed, an evil villager has opened up a black hole to destroy this village. You must build a bunker before all the villagers get sucked in. Be quick, in only a few minutes it could all be over. Wait, there's gonna be a black hole destroying this village? Villagers, what are you guys doing farming? You're supposed to go ahead and build this bunker before a giant black hole destroys everything. Well guys, it seems like they're a little bit confused. It's probably because they've never seen a black hole before. So let me go ahead and help them out by taking out every single one of these items, which it seems like is a lot, and hopefully we can help them out as much as we can. Cool, I haven't seen a diamond door before. This is gonna be awesome. So what I'm gonna do is go ahead and start building in a wonderful spot. Let me see where we can do this. I'm gonna start building, do you know what? Let's do it right here, I think this is good. So I'm going to start building down as much as we can, and I think I want to make it so that it's slightly open. The villagers are probably going to hate us by destroying part of their village, but once we finish, I think it will all make sense for them. Until then, I think they're going to have to get used to me destroying loads of stuff, and maybe they can question me later. Now, I want to make sure we get rid of this whole area as fast as we can. If we only have a few minutes until this black hole, I'm kind of scared we could get sucked in ourselves. And if that happens, it's game over. It could probably even suck in our whole YouTube channel. Well, guys, whilst we're building this, go ahead and subscribe down below and make sure you press the notifications bell. Because I'm not really sure if we're going to be able to make it until tomorrow. So if you guys press the notifications bell, you'll find out if we've made it. I think this type of size bunker is going to be great. So what I'm going to do is just go ahead and build all the way around like this. And hopefully we should have enough spots. Perfect and good. And there we go. Villagers, what do you think? Is this too big or is this kind of small? What I'm going to do is go ahead and build it like a little L shape. And if we do die, I guess that's the way it's going to be. Well, I see no villagers helping us out, which is kind of sad. And especially if we have to go ahead and save them and their children to make sure that the village doesn't get destroyed. Well, this villager is slightly panicking and I can fully understand why. If he's going to die, I would be doing the same. But I do probably guess they don't have opposable thumbs or even hands for that sake. So I think they could do very little. Well, let me go and clear out this area and hopefully we can get this bunker built as fast as we can. Look, I think they're actually trying to help me out, but they just don't know how. So they think jumping on the blocks will go ahead and break them. Sorry, villagers, that's not how it works. Well, guys, let me just go ahead and clear away this area and I'll be back in one second. It does take a very long time in destroying all this dirt. Well guys, what do you think? I think maybe it's a little bit too big. But I can already see the villagers are trying to figure out where they're all going to stay. So as soon as we start building, I think slowly by slowly it will all start making sense. Villagers, don't you guys worry. I'll have this done in no time. What I'm thinking is I want to make the floor probably out of iron. And then the roof, I want to make it fully out of glass. I don't want it to be dark inside whatsoever. Especially because if we're going to be inside this bunker a very long time, I want to make sure we aren't pretty much stuck in darkness because I don't think the villagers have figured out how to make torches yet so I think I'm gonna leave that for now well I'm super happy that so far we've been able to do so much but I'm a little bit scared that these villagers aren't gonna be able to figure out what we're doing villagers you guys are gonna have to move all right I think I need to go ahead and build around there very soon Perfect <laughs> and good and we are using up a lot of blocks which is not very good in the long run. I have a feeling we won't even have enough. Now I did want to make the doors sort of around there so I'm going to have to dig out that area and make sure the doors fit. So let's go and do this. Villagers you guys are really going to ruin the whole area so please stop messing around. You're making all our blocks disappear. It's absolutely awful and they are trying to trade us items that we don't even need. Okay let me just keep on building and hopefully very quickly they'll figure out what we're trying to do. I just don't think they get it. I think they don't fully understand exactly what an apocalypse is. Okay let's keep on going. And perfect and I think so far we've done such a good job and it's only taken us a few minutes okay let's keep going and perfect 
And there we go. Awesome. Villagers, that's not a ramp. You aren't supposed to use it that way. <laughs> I think they're all very quickly trying to go ahead and get back to their houses, which makes complete sense. So, guys, let's keep on going and let's make sure we get this whole area done, even if the villagers are trying to block us up. Okay, perfect and good. And there we go. Well, guys, what do you think? So far, we've done such a good job. But I'm kind of scared the apocalypse could happen at any moment. So I'm really trying to do this as fast as we can. And the villagers are just slowing us down so much. Okay, we've only got a few blocks left. This is not good. No, we've run out. Okay, maybe that's bad. But I'm going to have to go ahead and do the roof now out of glass. We have no other items to go ahead and use. Or maybe there could be more items inside the chair. So I'm going to have to go and check very soon. Let's just put all this glass around. And perfect. And hopefully it's good enough. Okay, guys, give me a minute. I'm just going to go ahead and finish off the roof and get out a few more items. I think we'll almost be done. I can start to hear some sirens, which makes it sound like the apocalypse is super close. Let me take out every single item and let's put in the items I don't see ourselves using for now. Villagers, the siren's going off. Please make your way to the bunker. And let me go and show you guys exactly how the bunker finished off. So this is the glass that's now the roof. And I've put up these stairs that I think might look great with these quartz. There we go. And perfect. Making everything so much easier for all the villagers. Let me do a diamond door. And perfect. And then another diamond door right here. And then I did notice we had some buttons. Let's do one here. And perfect. And then let's do exactly the same right here. There we go. See, it looks wonderful. But I am kind of scared that the villagers might get really scared so let's make this a wonderful home as fast as we can okay i've done a couple tables a couple chairs scattered around and perfect sort of like a little communal area for all the villagers and then i did notice we had some chests which i'm gonna scatter around just in case some villagers start fighting and this is gonna be our little workshop corner we've got our furnaces as well as our crafting tables and then i'm gonna scatter a few tvs scattered around so we can watch the news Okay, so far they're broadcasting nothing. And perfect. Well, I think this looks great. But we aren't finished yet. Let's just put all the items we've used away. And perfect. And let's take out the rest of these items. I think they want us to go ahead and put these diamond items. Just in case we need to break our way out. And let me put one bed here. And perfect. Another bed here. And then I am going to put another bed right in this corner. Perfect. And then I did notice they gave us some couches. Which I'm going to add sort of like around here somewhere let's do one here one there and there we go sort of like a little corner piece let's do a couple more here and perfect i think they should still be able to reach the furnace and then i want to make this chest the chest with all our food as well as all the furnishing that we won't be using again guys i think i hear it it's about to happen the siren's gone off again okay where's this apocalypse villagers get inside <laughs> i think this villager can't figure out how to get in there What's that sound? Something's happening. Wait, there it is. Okay, it seems like the black hole has appeared by the village and is dragging in all our poor villagers. Get inside the bunker. I have a feeling this is gonna get bigger and bigger as time goes on. Gosh, this is mental. Okay, it's dragging away all our blocks and I feel like if we don't back off from it, it might drag us in as well. Okay, this is super scary. Let's go check up on the bunker and make sure everyone's doing a ride inside. I have a feeling it might easily drag its way over. Oh look, they've all been dragged in as well. I think as long as they're in there, and even if they've been thrown about, it doesn't really matter. But the scary thing is, very soon this black hole is going to reach the village. No! Hold on, villager! It's going to be crazy! I have a feeling it's starting to go ahead and eat away from my chest. Let's take all these items out. I'm perfect. And I think it's going to start eating away at everything. I'm not really sure where all these items are going. Whoa, this is super scary. It's eating away as time goes on and all the villagers are getting sucked in. Villagers, don't let go. It's going to be crazy. Oh no, there they go. Oh, and I can see it. It's killing away all the poor villagers that get sucked in. Let me try and create some sort of blockade so they don't get eaten in and everyone can stay alive. Okay, I think this is not working out. No, this is crazy. Guys, I'm not really sure what to do. I think our bunker is keeping all the villagers safe, but it is dragging everyone else away. But look, even those flying blocks are probably going to start hurting people. Villagers, how are you all guys doing? Okay, I forgot to put all the animals inside the bunker as well. But I am hoping that very soon this black hole will die off and all the villagers will be alright. 
it is creating some sort of vortex, which is kind of scary. And it's also throwing items around, which I think once they land, they will place themselves. Okay, this is going to be such a scary day. And it has started around here. I think what we got to figure out is what villager started this evil black hole. Okay, I'm not really sure how to turn it off. But I am hoping that very soon, everything will die off once it hits bedrock. Hopefully Bedrock is strong enough to go ahead and stop this black hole. Guys, let's wait about a minute and let's see what happens when it gets closer to our bunker. I'm gonna try and go up there. It seems like it's creating some sort of structure. Okay, let's get a little bit closer and maybe it'll just try to go ahead and cover itself up. This might be the only way this black hole stops. If it covers itself up and it tries to sort of close itself in and destroy itself. Okay, let's go and have a quick look. Now, I want to make sure we don't get trapped in as well. So we got to be super careful and make sure nothing destroys us. Okay, I think this type of distance is all right. So far, rather than destroying this area, it's building it up, which is kind of unusual for us. I think maybe it's finishing. I don't see it getting rid of any more blocks and all the flying blocks have basically found a place to land. And I don't think it's destroying anything else, which I think is awesome. I think the bunker has gone ahead and worked. I think it saved as many villagers as it could. Let's go and have a quick look. Yep, they're still all alive. I think that's fantastic. Okay, I might keep on waiting just to see if this black hole disappears and maybe we can find out who's involved with this giant apocalypse. Well guys, I think we've done it. Even though it's still here, it just isn't destroying anything else. But sadly, all the villagers that didn't go inside the bunker have sadly died. But the bunker is still strong. Look, all the villagers are inside are doing super well. And I'm super happy to tell them that hopefully the black hole will just disappear by itself. But you know what? We can all live in here. Even though everyone's just jumping around, very soon they'll get used to it. Well guys, it's been super fun today going ahead and trying to survive the giant apocalypse. And thankfully, we've survived it, which I think is awesome. So guys, don't forget to like this video, subscribe down below if button is red, and don't forget to go ahead and press the notifications bell. Let's just have one last look and check if it's still going on. But I'm pretty certain it's now over. Well guys, that's it. The only thing I wanted to try is what happens if we jump in ourselves. Whoa! <laughs> this is crazy! Oh, okay, I kind of knew that was going to happen. But sadly, our spawn point is still inside. Well guys, I'll see you soon. Peace out.